hey everybody i've been so excited to do this i decided let me just do it i kept putting it off for this reason or that and i thought why don't i just admit that for some particularly odd reason you're just afraid to do it i thought why and i couldn't come up with an answer except that i wanted to give the lee steinberg super bowl party the proper presentation and i've done it in the past but i wanted to do it better when I hadn't done anything in a while. So here it is, okay? The Lee Steinberg 37th Super Bowl party will be at the Ahern Hotel and Convention Center in Las Vegas at 300 Severa Boulevard. It actually looks like this. And, well, yeah, there it is. Ahern Hotel and Events Center, I said. Well, events, conventions... Same thing, right? But there it is, folks. The Ahern. This is where it's going to be. 37th annual, but the first one ever in Las Vegas. And so you've got to be there for no other reason than that. So I want to dive into what this Ahern is about. I've been to Las Vegas a bunch of times. I've covered CES Las Vegas since, including this year or just credentialed yesterday, since 2010. I've never been to the Ahern. So first of all, let's get out of the way, first of all, what the Ahern is, and then we'll get into the party itself, all right? Because if you're watching this, chances are you're a little bit curious, you want to go, or you've been and you're excited to go, or you're excited to go, but you haven't been in quite some time. One of those categories. So first of all, let's get out of the way just what the Ahern is because, again, I've never been there before. This is what it looks like. But I managed to find this nifty kind of uh, place showing area. We call a map, right? <laughs> I just like to put that in there, okay? Uh, and some photographs. And here's what it really looks like without the Lee Sternberg, da, 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 right? There it is. This is on the north end of the Las Vegas Strip, all right? It is on the north end of the Las Vegas Strip. It is actually across the street from the Las Vegas Festival Grounds and Circus Circus. Yeah, it's that far north. And it its actual address is 300 West Sahara. Avenue, 300 West Sahara Avenue is where it's located. It will be, if you like, kitty corner to the Fountain Blue, because the Fountain Blue is going up at 67 stories. You can't miss it. So if I help you out by giving you, you know, a bit more than this and providing kind of a nifty look at the map, you'll have an even better idea of where it's located, especially if you happen to be, well, in Las Vegas for the first time, which is generally the case. 70% of the people who attend a Super Bowl have never attended the Super Bowl before. I think this is going to be a little bit different because it's in Las Vegas, but still, let's just go with that. Let's just assume that you've never been to Las Vegas before <laughs> so that we can get out of the way you know, where uh, this, this place is located, okay? Here is the map with it, all right? Now, there's the Ahern, of course, but on the map itself that I'm pointing to, all right, here, this is the Las Vegas Festival Grounds. You see how me circling it? The cursor right there, all right? There is the, the condos, all right? The lower condos, all right? And then in terms of the location of this nice, nice facility that you want to be at, it's just right over across from there. And so all you have to do is I would recommend taking an Uber up there uh, or a shuttle. And if you're going to come in on that Saturday, uh, there may very well be special Super Bowl buses. I don't know because this is really far out from the date which will be February 10th, the day before the Super Bowl. Super Bowl party 
Lee Steinberg's is always the day before the Super Bowl. It generally starts at 12 noon and goes until five o'clock. Um, that time has not been set yet. Now, let's go out a little bit more and just a little bit more and just a little bit more because what we have here is all the other hotels and there's the Ahern right here. See where it says top rated. There it is. It's funny, the closer in that we got, the harder it was to, you know, pinpoint that down. One moment. All right, family business. Now, as I was saying, the Ahern is right here. You can just circle it, right? That, see that? That's the strat. But uh, I just had it where it lit up. Uh, now it doesn't want to light up for me. We'll put, there it is. Boom. See that? The Ahern, okay? That's the Ahern. And It's right across the street, as I said, from the Las Vegas Festival grounds. And if you take a look at this, you just go right across the street. There's Circus Circus. All right. The festival grounds are in this area here. All right. The Hilton Grand Adventures. Now, the Fountain Blue will be here. The Strat is just right behind it over here. You can see it. All right. So that's what that's where the Ahern is located now. In the total picture of all things Las Vegas, this is the North Strip. So if we go out further, further, and further, you still we, we still have the Ahern, right? That's North Strip, right? This is South Strip, okay? So if we were to, to, to zoom in and then go down the street, right? Down the street. So we've got, and then you keep going down the street, all right? And further down, okay, you've got all the rest of the, I like to say, goodness of, of Las Vegas here, where if I stop it right here, I've got the, I went down too far, the Luxor, the MGM, Bellagio, Palms, Orleans. If I go up a little bit further here, I've got the Venetian. And of course, Sphere is right over here, although it's not marked. Shame on this Google map. All right. And the Las Vegas Convention Center is actually right here. There's Bellagio, right? But the Convention Center itself is actually kind of tucked away right over here. This is actually not Las Vegas. It's actually Paradise. Nevada. But point is, the airport is right here, Harry Reid International Airport. Okay. So you're just a taxi drive or a Uber ride, or I should say taxi ride or Uber ride to the Ahern. Here's the Ahern. Now, if you want to stay there at the Ahern, let's check the availability for the future. Let's check the availability for the 10th of February, see what that lands us. So we go up, let's say you're going to leave like a Super Bowl after the Super Bowl. Let's say you're looking at, oh, Super Bowl. Uh, let's see here. There's the 10th, right? So you're gonna leave on the twelfth. Let's see you wanna you wanna get there. 
I just went past that. So you get there on the 9th, and you leave on the 12th. Boom. Okay? Like that, right? All right. Now, it's a, they're available. Guess what? Well, well, okay, it doesn't give you the rates for that. It says available Friday, February 16th through Monday, February 19th from 170. So what they are for this one, it says contact the property for rates and availability. Da, 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 da. Why? Well, it's Super Bowl time, folks. <laughs> but there are plenty of places to stay around there because the Ahern, you better hurry up and, and check on the Ahern and its availability. Now I say that because knowing that Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party is going to be there, the Ahern is likely to fill up within the next month or two. All right. So get on it, contact them, find out what the rates are. But you've got, again, a number of options nearby. You have Circus Circus, the new Fountain Blue. Sky high rates over there, my goodness. You have a number of choices. The Strat right next door. So that's what's happening. So that's where the Ahern is located. Uh, and in terms of um, another view of what it's like, inside the Ahern. Uh, uh, I'm going to give you that in this next presentation slide as I stop the screen and change. Okay. And then we'll get to the goodness that is the least darn super, super Bowl party. But as I, excuse me, uh, shift screens here and we go over to uh, more on the Boutique itself, the Ahern, there it is. That's what I'm looking for. That, okay. And we scroll down here. We have these different photos of it. It says view all photos at a glance. That's what the room looks like. Pretty nice. Very nice. Got a nice little table there and office set up nice bed it's a pool well lit bathroom mm, good food in the restaurants there are many there's the ahern itself you can see how close it is to the strat if you need, can't get a room at the ahern try the strat strato 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 fierce strato <laughs> this i, I want to say stratotastic i don't know why great restaurants here, stratosphere, and more rooms, hallways, other rooms. The Ahern has four giant meeting rooms. Chances are, since the total capacity for those meeting rooms is 480, I think it's a fair bet the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party is going to have a throughput capacity of 1,000. In other words, people coming in and going out, filling up the place through the day but not all at once. The Ahern, great food, mmm, yummy. Great looking place, nice accommodations. A luxury boutique hotel at least Steinberg has picked out for his 37th Super Bowl party. And so now, if you wanna find out more information in other words, if you want to call them, okay? All you've got to do is dial these digits right here. I'm going to copy and paste right there. And that's the number for the Ahern, folks. This is, the number is 725 area code 214-4800. That's 725 area code 214-4800. Again, 725. I want you to have this drilled in your brain. 725-214-4800 for the Ahern. Get on it. Get your rooms. Even if you just want to go there and have a quick meal before the party or something, do that. But make sure you get there early for the least time for Super Bowl party. Show up by noon or 11. The brain health summit generally starts at 11 o'clock. I'm certain that'll be the case this time. Get there to find out the latest regarding 
the ongoing effort to lower concussions to the rate of zero in football and realize overall better brain health for you and me. So check that out. All right. Now, let's talk about the real deal. Let's talk about the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party and what it is. Now, it started over on 109 Panoramic and it's placed in the Berkeley Hills as a party at his house. I'd never been to that one. I've been I've been to Lee's old place because Lee was helping me and Oakland Bay Elihu Harris during the time that I was Elihu's economic advisor. That's how I met Lee. And I went up there oh, a couple of times, three, four times, five times, pick up stuff from Marina and all that stuff. Okay. Anyway, uh, been there, not for the party. It was a big, it was a, well, it was four stories on a hill in Berkeley and you go up there and uh, it was quite nice. Uh, it was uh, a dreamy place. I, could, I it was it was perfect for Lee. Perfect for Lee. I haven't been to Lee's uh, home or office in Newport Beach yet, and I need to get there because I'm getting too old. <laughs> Lee, invite me. Anyway, uh, but it started out there at least my Super Bowl party. But when he moved down to Newport, and uh, it became something bigger. Huge, 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 huge. And it went from that to, well, here's an example of a party that I attended. I've been to nine Lieb Steinberg Super Bowl parties. But here is a party that I went to in Atlanta, 2019. Let me get rid of that. I'll play this for you so you can get an idea of what was going on at this converted church uh, here. Here is what that was like right there, okay? There, if you can hear that. that is That's the presentation of the humanitarian awards. Let me try that again. That's the presentation of the Humanitarian Awards. Sorry about the brief interruption there, squeaking. Oh, hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? Good, good. Good. Just packed. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing, folks. Be ready for crowds. I'm going to fast forward a little bit here. Hold on. Our next award will be my partner I think Lee needed a bigger boat. <laughs> Thank you, Lee. Our next recipient is really a great man, John Robinson, the general manager in the Tennessee Titans. And I'd like to have Jay on Brown and David Stokes represent and join me up before the stage. How are you? And come on, boys. We want to recognize John for his tireless efforts in supporting juvenile diabetes research. So, John, please come up. Uh, 
thanks so much for the place. We're really uh, lucky. It's a blessing to work in the National Football League. So that's kind of a taste of what Lee does. He celebrates NFL executives and owners through events like this humanitarian awards uh, session. And he had actually a longtime friend of his a little later uh, come up and, and be presented. And I thought it was a, a very nice very nice thing for Lee to do, uh, and you might uh, recognize this man uh, when you do it. And I'm going to fast forward a little bit so that you can uh, enjoy this part of that event right here. And here it is. I'll take it away, Lee. <laughs> So that was a great, it was a great thing that Lee did for Mark Davis. It was a very nice gesture. They've been friends for a long, long time. But that's not the only thing that happens at the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party. Uh, there's a lot of people and events and stories and discussions. And, oh, my goodness, I'm going to take you through some of the well, let's take, for example, this was from seven years ago. This is uh, an app. You can actually present a... You have a I have no idea. I just found out. It's you the coolest thing. What's it about? Yeah, what's the coolest thing? Like, this, is, this is what you're hearing back there is the presentation of my friend talking about a new app that he learned about at the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party in San Francisco for Super Bowl 50. That's Roger Schoenbaum. And this is the app. It's called Theta. It's a 360 app. This was at the Metreon. All right, T take it away, Ragu. I have no idea. I just found out. It's the coolest thing. What's it about? Yeah, what's the coolest thing I've seen? 360 degree camera, smile. Oh, what, what, what just happened there? What just happened there? It's just going to come out. It's stitching it in camera right now, and then it'll send it right. It's got Wi Fi built in, so you can fire it from your. Oh, so you got all of us in it. See? That is cool. That's good. That's why I said it's an app, right? Where is uh, it it's, 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 oh, it's here. Yeah, it's this guy. Oh, it's that thing. It's got a you need this. I need this. You need this. How do I get one of these things? Those things. How do I get one? Yeah, yeah. It's called Teddy's card. Okay, cool. I'll take that. Email Teddy. I like that. Why is it called Peter? Are you Peter? Yeah, right. Why is it called Peter? Right. Oh, because it's Peter. I get it. That's the name of the camera. I, I know, but I'm saying why that name. What's the name of the thing? I don't know what it stands for. It's a Japanese company. Oh, so I, it I thought it was a girl. Why do you say Peter? Why don't you? Why don't you say the top? The top. I, I say the top. The top. Yeah. That's the best. I, best. You say potato. It's I say potato. <laughs> yeah. You mean the tagline could be "I'm watching you." Hey, right. tell them the website. Rico Imaging.com. Rico Imaging.com. Rico Imaging.com. Rico Imaging.com. Got it. Thank you. I got to go back They're a little bit. Because, from your... Whoa, that so you're, is... At least I'm... The least time for Super Bowl party is nothing without friends. That's my good friend, Steven Schnitzer. His sister, Beth, has been my long, long, long time, long time awesome friend and everything. Uh since 2000 oh my lord that's 24 years beth almost yeah so anyway uh 
Natalie dressed. He's got his, he looks like a model. He's got his glasses on. If you're ever in the Miami Beach, South Beach, he and his brother Raisin Snitcher have the famous 11th Street Diner. Just want to put that out there. But Lee Steinberg's Super Bowl party is about business. It's about presenting your best business self to potential clients. It's about learning about products that are available. It's about entrepreneurs. That's the best, one of the best, not the best, the only best, but that's one of the best things I can say about the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl parties. You meet some of the most fascinating people at this event. Now, Steve, we've been to nine of these things together as a group, all right? But, but regarding Theta, the product itself is just one example of the kind of products that you're going to learn about. Or if you have a product you want to present to a ready, willing, and able audience, do it at the least time Mary Super Bowl party. Now, here's another example of what I'm talking about along those lines and who you will meet and see and what kind of cool products you'll uh, encounter and people encounter along the way. Now, you would say, well, Zinni, did you actually you know, talk to you know, Lee himself. Well, yeah, I did. Uh, I always do. Here's Lee right here uh, at the, and this is at the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party. I believe this is an Arizona. Great to see you, my man. Oh, you're always with us wherever we're having a great event. Yeah, that's right. So tell us about the event and the humanitarian award as well. So, so this is our 28th annual Super Bowl party. And we gather people from business, politics, sports, uh, together, always for a cause. And our cause is today our Woody Johnson, the owner of the Jets, is giving, getting a humanitarian award for work in public health. Dennis Hickey, the GM of the Miami Dolphins, is getting one for his work in Special Olympics. Jeff Fisher from his work with the Wounded Warrior Project, right. and lastly, uh, Jonathan Babineau, a player who's done 84 different characters. So we're trying to represent the, we're trying to uh, honor and represent the, um, the best in what NFL people do. Nice, nice. How do you feel, man? This is great. Oh, it's yeah. great. Tell yeah. so much about your clients, by the way. Well, this yeah, is great. Yeah, yeah. Um, Ari Lee, who's a, uh, a, a tight end uh, from Bowie State, mm -hmm. um, who did really well at the East West. We have um, the your quarterback too, right? We have a quarterback. Yeah. yeah. Well, I thought did well actually, even though you know yeah. I was really impressed with his form. Taylor you know? Heineke. Yeah. And uh, from Old Dominion, mm -hmm. and, and we have uh, offensive lineman Ben Beckwith from Mississippi. Garrett. Gilbert will be here. Yeah, on the Gilbert Gilbert for our last video. Yeah, that's right. And yeah. uh, so a year later, it's happy. And uh, there we go. And the list is growing. And the list goes hey, on. Hey, high five on that one, man. Yeah, cool. Good to see you. Yeah, so that's Lee. Always, always a, a great person, a mentor, a lot of fun, great advice. And But that's not all there is at the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party. There is a lot more, folks. And, for example... I, um, you know, for those of you who are party animals or you're, well, look, Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party, you've got athletes. And so among athletes, you're going to have some of the hottest women. Okay. Look, if you, you know, as I am in that orientation. Uh, and so the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party is certainly in the area of delivering on that. And they're also extremely well accomplished in their own right. So if you're a bachelor, we're a talent interaction platform. And what we're doing is sending messages to the troops um, wherever they are. So just to let them know that we're thinking about them. We've also got something where we're allowing them to transition back into the workplace when they're, you know, back from service. So this is a way to get back to the, uh, yeah, just the, the yeah, application there. Absolutely. Is this your company? Hired it is not. It is David's company and Chip's company. Their company. Okay, yeah. yeah. Cool. Is it hiredview.com? Is that? Hiredview.com. That's right. right. And this yeah. is the app, right? Yeah. 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 Y
right. This cap right here. So you can just take a quick interview and just say thank you. Great. Right. I'll take a look at that. Why is it now you have to check it out? I thought it was about you guys. No, <laughs> no, no. She's just the eye candy. She's the eye candy. She's your eye candy, too. Come on. You know? We'll get in and take a video. I am. It's this video. She, she doesn't know this is video. No, this you is have video. to do a video. I have to do it? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm going to do a video right now. Okay. Right. Thank you. So anyway, <laughs> that, that is, folks, someone's got to do the dirty work of capturing with the Lee Steinberg party is about to a degree. It's one part presenting your company and its wares. The other part, yeah, good looking, beautiful people. And I would say accomplished people as well some of the smartest people to ever want to meet in your entire life. And not only that, you never know when you're going to meet an actor or an Olympian or someone who's both an actor and an Olympian, unless you actually happen to meet them. And so you've got more episodes. You've got instances of, well, like, 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 for example, okay, I believe uh, this was uh, from the New York Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party. If I can get around this, uh, skip this ad. And here, this is, this is Arizona. He says, wait a second. Oh, that was a presentation. Sorry, that was the wrong one. I had a little music to that one. But uh, here we are. Here's my friend, Megan Alexander from Inside Edition. All right, hey, everybody. Uh, Megan here Alexander from Inside Edition. Hey, here everybody. Go. Megan watch, Alexander watch. from Inside Edition. Awesome. So, I'm trying to freeze this and bring it back. So you, you heard the volume. So now you can. All right, hey, everybody. It. Megan Alexander from Inside Edition. So, and from the Titans. And from. You guys live in Nashville, right? Yes. Yeah, cool. yeah, so give me a prediction for the game, Megan. Sorry. Seahawks. Seahawks. Uh, no surprise there, right? Yeah, how about you? Well, I have a, I have a friend who plays for the Patriots, yeah. so I'm going to go for them. Go okay. Kylie. Okay. okay, so give me a score <laughs> since you're like, yeah. Oh, I think it's going to be close. Okay. I think this will be a close game, unlike last year. I think it's going to be a blowout. You think so? Blowout. 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 Yeah, blowout. I mean, it's Seahawks. Seahawks? Yeah. Wow. You're going to blow out. Yeah, what's that you? What's that you? Yeah. Um, yeah. I'll be you. Fair prediction for that. 3124. Okay. So follow her on Twitter too and watch her on Inside Edition. Cool. All right. Sure. So there so there's Megan from, I hear from that. She actually introduced me to Miss Universe. I interviewed I interviewed Miss Universe because of Megan Alexander. Thank you, Megan. Very nice. And not only do we have celebrities like my friend Megan Alexander. We've got other people uh, that come to his party, and you got to give a shout out to Cosmo De La Cole, his sidekick. Here is Cosmo, who has helped. Uh, One down, nine to go. Excuse me, who has helped present his Super Bowl parties, I think for 15 years now. Uh, Lee, Lee may want to correct me on that. Let me. Uh, let this ad play. A little money in my pocket. Hey, what are you doing out here? I just had something picked up. Oh my gosh, I'm having something delivered. Carvana. You know Carvana. Searched it, bought it, scheduled it. Ah, and here it is. You think Carvana's good for buying? You should try selling one. Oh my gosh, it's almost identical. You gotta have backup. You know what I said. Okay, so there's... Cosmo, great to see you again. Uh, it's great to be here. What a great day it is. It's about football. But even more so, it's about people and their humanitarian efforts. NFL is full of amazing people that do fantastic things. Deron Cherry. Oh, I love Deron. Look, he's a Jersey guy. I'm a Philly guy. There is a river called the Delaware River that probably is right between us. But <laughs> at the end of the day, we probably live five miles from each other. So five miles and a couple of years separated us. Stephen Ross. Yep. Yeah. Uh, he's amazing. Look, he's a very successful guy. Yes. He didn't have to come here today. He's the host. So he shows up. He's gracious. He takes the award. He does some beautiful things. And you have great clients. Tua Tagalavoa. 
Well, we're, them, right? yeah, we're really that. pumped about him. And, wow. You know, he's making a speedy recovery. You know, obviously he's going to be one of the top choices in the draft. And he's a great Two young up. man. All right, cool. Cosmo, great guy. And so now we have Cosmo. We've got, would you believe, other people as well. We have going down lists. I'm really randomly doing this. You're saying, Zinni, did I plan this? Well, yeah, I did in a different way. And this is one of my favorites because this one actually features, this is in Miami again before. This is in 2008. And uh, what you're about to see are two stars of a, a company, a TV program called Sports Night. And they were filming a segment involving Lee Steinberg as well. Lee Steinberg, right? So playing himself. Here it is. It's on the yacht. February 3rd, 2007. <laughs> Seven folks, ahead of the game on that one. Sports action team, that's it. filmed something with Lee where I was fired from Sports Action Team and I actually went back and got a job and landed on my feet with Super Agent Lee Steinberg. Ah, uh, okay. Cha -ching. So you were an intern, you graduated from USF Sports Management Company. Uh, yeah. I did, and yeah. I landed on my feet with Al, with, Al, with Lee, and uh, he really took me out of the wings. And uh, it's been a long time since I've seen him and I kind of miss him to be honest with you. Yeah, we did a bit. So when Steven gets fired from the show, then uh, lands on his feet over Lee Steinberg's. And uh, Lee actually came up with the idea, which we love, of uh, that it was kind of like a new relationship. Mm -hmm. His previous relationship was like an abusive boyfriend thing. Ah, so I, I kept see. Coming yeah, back into his like, office. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep returning into his office, being like trying to get him back, spying on him, and all this stuff. Ah. Lee clearly is. You mean stalking? Well, I mean, you know, <laughs> uh, yeah. 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 Romance, black heart. Oh, no, okay. But, uh, ah. <laughs> but it's uh, it, it was it's really fun. So yeah, no, Lee is uh, Lee, Lee was a champ, and so now we're gonna do another bit. I mean, clearly, he's having the greatest party here. Yeah. In oh, Florida. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and I, I and Steven's sort of reconnecting with his old yeah. boyfriend, quote unquote. Hey, for my blog, can you guys give your names? Like, yeah. sure, I'm Steven Tlumy. And uh, it's Al Samuels. Al Samuels. Our characters on the show. Sports are, action team. That's action right. Team. Yeah. Sports action team. Yep. It's NBC? a yeah. NBC show. Yeah. 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 I know. I, I know. I watched the show, but I just wanted people to, you know. Yeah. Yeah. yeah jump in. Uh, NFL Super Bowl game. It's our favorite blog. Check Tune it into out. It. Download right. it, buy it on iTunes. If it's not viable, write, write iTunes. It will be. It will, it will be. be. Yeah, it will be. Write, right, can right. you write iTunes? If you can yeah. write them, write That's them right. and tell them to, to carry this. It's, a, it's an amazing show. Awesome. Best yeah. in the biz. Now, hi, hey, everybody. Hi. So, where are we? Greetings from Miami Beach, Hollywood. Yeah. Awesome. We're going, going closer. Going closer together. <laughs> now, these aren't just anybody, folks. That's my friend Beth. I mentioned her brother was in the previous video, two videos away, away from that. That's my longtime friend, Jay Randy Gordon, who actually helped us on the first Super Bowl effort, my, well, my trying to bring Super Bowl to Oakland. And that's his uh, girlfriend there. And uh, that was in Miami. That was 2007, the 21st Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party in Miami. Now. That's great. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Go Bucks. Go Bucks. Go Bucks. Go Bucks. All right. There we go. 
Most people have no clue that in 2023, the best way to make money on Amazon is not with physical. All right, back to the action. This is Bruce Perlmutter. I am the general manager of the first ever Tribeca ESPN Sports Film Festival. And we launch in April of this year, 07. And for the first time ever, we're going to have sports films showcased from around the world. It's its own festival with its own original content. We're going to have a website up. We're going to have a big premiere gala of the, uh, the big film that's going to be coming out in April, and it's going to be an unbelievable event. We're hoping that we can generate some interest in, in around the world, and we hope you come and see us in New York in, Tribeca in April and May. It's an exciting venture. Does anybody have any idea how many sports films there are out there? There are a lot of sports films. For the first one, for us, we're going to have between 15 to 20 films, and they're all never before seen independent films, and um, we have already got a really, really great interest with the, uh, the partnership of ESPN and the background and the knowledge and what Tribeca does for, for a living, which is how, the festivals. How can people contact you? Uh, is there a website? Uh, there is a website. The best thing to do right now is to go to www.tribecafilmfestival.org and then there will be a link page directly to the Tribeca ESPN Sports Film Festival. Excellent. All right. Thank you. Thank you. director but he's a gentleman that'd like to speak about all right he's gonna put it on me see okay he's gonna turn, <laughs> turn away from me. Okay. all right now with the show is about fashion it's about a lifestyle about being yourself so it's all about being real it's all about doing you and about your own personal distinction now the key to it all is that in order to be successful in life you really have to dig deep within yourself and just be yourself stop portraying stop portraying and trying to be what you're not right saying what you're not right so everything is real on the production of what we got going on in our lives and what's happening right and what we're working and inspiring towards and we are working on developing a new publication called fashion that's really innovative in the industry right now and so it's going to be a, the first magazine catalog to hit the industry and it's going to be showcasing the lifestyle that proposes to showcase and also push the whole concept of being yourself. Yeah, that's right. At the same time, offer you the same time to be able to buy whatever's there. Yeah, and you're so you, you guys know. well presented too. You're like, oh, well, thank you. It's smooth. Look at that. Also, it's got like oh, look at that. It's, it's so called urban sophistication. Yeah, and, you know, something yeah, a different, definitely. sexy, and uh, at the same time, yeah. a whole lot of fun. You got to live life, you might as well have fun with it. Yeah, absolutely. And live it fashionably. And so what we do every day is a new term. And I need to go ahead and put a patent on this, and I'm going to go ahead and loan it out to everybody who's watching this. And it's, it's a mixture between yeah. business and pleasure, and we call it pleasure. 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 Yeah. It's like all that. about pleasure. Making business pleasure. a pleasure, pleasure. pleasure, and it's a pleasure, pleasure doing business. I like that. It's all about pleasure in 07. Yeah, it's pleasure. all about pleasure. That's you it. heard that from the Miami Fashion Statement, Chris Fashion, yeah. Edwin the Stylistocrat. And remember, we super bowling! Yeah, all right. <laughs> right. I like that. Yeah. Super Bowl. Website? Website? Yeah. It's actually going to be up and running in about two weeks. Two weeks. Okay. Super Bowl! Yeah. Super Bowl! Alright, 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 cool. Oh, that's oh, that's multiple pictures. So that's uh. 
Finn and Maya found a great flight deal with Price that was a, because That was a lot of fun, folks. Again, that was another, that was from the 21st Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party in Miami. And, uh, but again, in this kind of film festival of Super Bowl party videos from Lee Steinberg's events, uh, there's more, folks. And we go from Miami to we already went to New York. We go from Miami to back to Atlanta, where I met Laura Langmire, millionaire. Oh, I recognize she was the millionaire matchmaker, and I had the pleasure of meeting her in Atlanta. And here she is in all of her glory. This is the great. I need to give her a call and see how she's doing. Laura Langmire. This is Lady. She's Laura Langmire, and she was on Dr. Phil and CNBC. And five New York Times five, bestsellers. Five New York Times bestsellers. And I don't know what else I'm leaving out, but what do you got? Just to talk? Yeah, what do you got going talk? on now? Well, I have so much going on. Like, so I've been shark since before Shark Tank even knew what we were doing. I love which it. Which means <laughs> talk on. This is great. I love it. So seriously, <laughs> like, so you either get to be rich or to be poor, and I teach you how to do that. And then I shark stuff. So like, this is my new shark adventure. So it's called Gridiron we'll and CBD. Yeah. yeah, it is. Got it. Yeah. So Gridiron is a black water that changes the entire brain structure for CT and dementia guys for the NFL. So we're doing a pilot study for the NFL alumni. So Ray Machester's already involved. You already met like Donald I know Ray. Ray. Hey, Ray, and how you doing, man? Yeah. Right, so they've been taking this for like a year. And they will absolutely, they're off any like steroids are off any meds. They're only on CBD and this water because it's alkaline and it's like that. Can it work for just middle aged guys like me? Well, yeah. Yeah. It so, wow. like pre workout, post workout is amazing. But for the guys, anybody, like I've got four concussions. I'm a rollerblader. I'm a, you know, like my latest one was I was in my own airplane. And I had a 2800 pocket drop. I got a huge concussion, what? which is why I have these braces. You had a what? A pocket drop. I had a huge concussion like uh, 18 months ago, which is why I have these awesome braces. I'm 53 years old. So wow. I'm super committed to helping people who have concussions. Wild. Like, get it I've fixed. Never you heard cannot that. have concussions and think your brain's not going to get effed up. Sorry, no, you did. This. No, this stuff's amazing. So I, I met it, I found it, um, I helped fund it, and now we're helping the NFL alumni. And then once we prove that it works, then we're going to the NHL, the soccer teams, MMA. Like, you, like I don't know how many people watching have had concussions. It's got to be you. How can they find out more about it? So they got to call me directly. Just I'm, I'm, can I get myself? It's like do anything you it's want. Be to. All right, so call me. Just text me seven seven five nine zero one three nine nine eight. And I'll let you know. I will send you some like black water, we call it. And black water will change your life. I gotta ask you a question. What is it? How do you build how does one build one celebrity? Because it seems like that's what it takes today. It does. You know, to, to sell your product is you sell yourself, right? Well, it's finding influencers, is finding which is my NFL alumni guys who are just superstars. So like I have my own following and credibility, got a million people following me. But these guys have been it. So I'm going for the NFL, my son's a football player, and then we're gonna keep going. My daughter's an MMA, was an MMA fighter, so we're just gonna keep like making a difference. Wow. Yeah, it's good. You gotta change your lives because their brain's gonna screw them up and probably like they'll die. Folks, Don't I'm, do I'm that. getting this product, okay? Here you go. Red eye. Gotta go. Thank you. Thank you. Lovely, lovely lady. It took me, her and her business partner, David, took me to dinner at uh, Axis in Buckhead after that. Uh, wonderful Laura Landmark. But again, another example of what the Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party is all about. Great people doing great things, starting their own businesses, expert networkers, attractive, smart, engaging, fun, and inspiring. That's what I have gotten from attending Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party a number of new friends and always looking forward to the next party. And that's what the party in Las Vegas is going to be like. I guarantee it. And I'm going to show you one more example from the Bart Steinberg Super Bowl party. I think I'll go to Scottsdale. This is an 18 minute film. So I think what I'm going to do is take part of it. Okay. Uh, 
and and show you that. Here it is. Um, well, I, so as soon as we stop driving, I'm gonna I'll put the phone in his hands. That's my friend. He has been talked directly, huh? Five minutes. Let us get. Let's get. Let us stop here. We're all confused. Yeah, Jenny. Maybe you can read it. It's your this is freaking wow! Great. Look at these cactuses. Man. I know. Should I should be filming for you? Oh, look at that one. This is great. This is cool, right? It's at the botanical gardens in Phoenix. Yeah, see Lee Steinberg. <laughs> Lee Steinberg. No, it's not downtown. I don't know. You have to take fifty-one. 51202 Loop Botanical 51. Gardens. Jenny's going about 40. Yeah, <laughs> it's like, <laughs> and Phil, well, like, he's, he's going to put you on the list. You got it. Are you going to come or not? Well, let's say you need to talk to him. Uh, this party, guys? Yes, we're ready we're for this ready. party. Yeah, we're ready. Ready, ready for ready. the party. Sorry. 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 Good. Sorry. Good. Feel good. You got it. Yeah. All right, all right. Let's go. Go, Giants. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Okay. Okay. I'm on the board. Take a picture of all the cactuses. Yeah. That's uh, just kind of a welcome card. Says what's going on inside. And okay. There's a message from Lee on the back as well. Thank you. 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 Thank uh, club is a, a foundation that helps kids uh, stay on the right path. Uh, we are primarily focused on uh, prevention programs versus intervention programs, and we also uh, are getting involved nationally with an interactive website uh, that will be able to be used not only for fundraising purposes, but also to track results and make sure these kids stay on the right path, stay off drugs, uh, stay uh, off alcohol, off smoking, and more importantly, staying in school. What's the website address and how can one get involved? The website is uh, beatingtheodds.org. And you get on that website, and we have links into uh, Lee's Quarterback Club, um, and you'll be able to make donations right off the website. All right. Hey, thank you. Thank you. Might be about 20 to 25 years somewhere there. He's got a long time. He can't be released back out into the wild. Uh, his first name is Maverick. His name is Maverick. He's a Peregrine Falcon. And hey, Maverick. Yeah, we name all of our Peregrines that come to us at Liberty Wildlife after famous flyers. So we have a female, Amelia Earhart. He's Maverick. Our other one right now is. Jester. Maverick, like top dude. And uh, we're up at Liberty. We uh, wildlife rehabilitation center, and we try to get uh, we get in about three thousand to four thousand animals each year that are sick, injured, orphaned. And we do our best to get them back out. Uh, Maverick couldn't make it back out after with his injuries. We got his wing fixed, but he has some neurological damage oh. uh, as a result of it. And it keeps him from flying. Oh, poor and uh, this guy really needs to fly in order to be out there in the wild. Yeah. We get that. Hey, thanks. We got an island. Oh, this is trippy. This is right. Still trying to check this. Oh, right. 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 It's yeah. beautiful. Nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Seth and Steven. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Hey, there he is. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Nice. Oh, that one's got a really big wing stand. I love it. Yeah. Oh, really? Very nice. Okay. Nice to meet you. Good for the environment. Great. Definitely. You know, help it out. Yeah. Yeah. You guys having a great time? Yeah. Excellent. 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 Look good and green. Yeah. Another foot right there. Perfect. Hey, Lee, your party is uh, great as usual. Nice you guys. Nice to you. Center on the Green Initiative. You can talk more about how that came to be. And We're kicking off the Sporting Green Alliance today, which is our effort to get franchises for sports franchises in 
football, baseball, basketball that have stadia, arena, practice fields, and trying to incorporate uh, technologies which are green in energy, solar, wind, in an attempt to uh, drop their carbon load and to save energy. That's the first goal. The second goal is to turn them into educational platforms because it means people who come into those institutions have the opportunity to experience green technologies and practices for the very first time. And uh, so we think it can have a major impact and sports always is a role model and it can continue to play a, a vital role in uh, making a difference and leading the way. So. Um, so this will be our effort to to try and and take this party and we'll be exposing people to a variety of different interesting technologies i'm curious if your time is short but how what about the education process i personally find that there are people who don't even know what a, a, a carbon platform is yes. you know how is that coming along how are you going about that part of educating well, the people that you're working with you know? i think they'll see uh, what we're going to to do here in terms of everything from uh, recycling to the way we're using Using energy here in the uh, uh, grid, uh, it's we've given them uh, complete illustrations of every single aspect of uh, the party. So we're, we'll have fun here. We're going to release uh, endangered uh, owl into the wild, uh, and and of course we have <laughs> that the was green carpet, <laughs> the right. red carpet. Uh, and, and, That'll be uh, fun. And we're doing some different things. So, uh, look, it's uh, we have troops that are in the uh, in the field, and uh, so we'll be doing a closed circuit hookup, which links this party to our troops in um, Iraq and yeah, Afghanistan. Excellent. And so we think that'll be uh, good too. But the Super Bowl. Is yeah. So uh, hold on a second, folks. Uh,
Okay, we're back. Let me go back to uh, Lee there. I'll have to cut out that segment, I think. As, as, as you know, San Diego is a, a convention of Americana. It's got big business, big sports, and uh, and I'm happy to say that my former uh, partner, Jeff Morad, who I uh, practiced uh, with for uh, 20 years, is taking the Arizona Diamondbacks, and that'll be our first uh, oh, excellent. Be excellent. Our first franchise and uh, that we'll use these uh, green concepts with. And um, so the, uh, and we think it'll spread. Uh, if you really think about the aggregation of all those buildings all across the country, it starts to become significant. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Great party, Lee. Thank Thanks. you very much. Yeah. How's your client, Ricky Williams? Ricky is doing great. He's, uh, he's rehabbing very well, and I think he'll, um, He's on the rehab trail. Uh, Bill Parcells is uh, excited about having him back, and I think that uh, you'll see him get uh, uh, have a, a, a productive uh, season very soon. I will tell you about one new thing we're doing, which is the group athletes for Obama. Excellent. Uh, Excellent. Uh, Obama. I'm an Obama right. supporter. Race twenty thousand. Uh, okay. yeah. <laughs> well, we have. A, if it says we're hitting uh, you up. <laughs> We have a uh, uh, tentative board of uh, directors, which uh, of uh, co-chairs, which would be Reggie Bush, mm -hmm. uh, Barrett Davis, Michael Jackson, uh, Warren Moon, and Charles Barkley, and I would be the chair. I think this is uh, traditionally, as you know, uh, athletes are apolitical, and most of them are Republicans. Right. Definition of a conservative athlete is a campus liberal who just saw the withholding from his bonus check <laughs> um, but but i think that this this is an extraordinary time it's a um, and an extraordinary candidate who uh, casper catches encapsulates the the uh, hopes and, and dreams of a new generation and uh, so it, uh, it's very unusual to have athletes. I mean, I think that the normal ethos is captured by Michael Jordan, who famously said that uh, Republicans buy sneakers too. Excellent. Thank you, Link. Okay. Thank you. So that was uh, a good part. It's a good taste of what his party is like. Uh, a lot of people, here's another scene with Lee and the bird. I think this is Jan Janet Lapanotano, who was our Homeland Director, Homeland Security, uh, Homeland Director was invited and they were trying to send off this bird. I don't know if this is going to play or not, but the bird had other ideas. The bird sort of took off uh, over the heads of everybody. Everyone ducked. I th <laughs> it was absolutely hilarious. Uh, I think I've got that. Well, here we go. All right. Yeah. Technologies into stadiums and arenas and practice fields around the country to make them more environmentally friendly, drop the energy loads on them, turn them into teaching platforms so that sports again can lead the way when it comes to combating global warming and being a leader in this field. So that's our first uh, mission. Um, our second is that we do want to pay homage to our troops and recognize that we still have troops that are in the field in harm's way. And um, we, and the Army has been very helpful, thanks to uh, Congressman Gifford. They have a flight simulator, which is outside the party for those of you who want to experience it. And we uh, have a number of troops here, so uh, we'd like all of you to, uh, to uh, interact with them. But uh, please remember, we do need to be serious about moving back global warming and um, integrating these concepts into our own lives. Uh, thank you so much, Governor, for having us here. Thank you to uh, the cities of Phoenix and Scottsdale. 
Uh, thank you to all of our staff for working so hard. At four o'clock, we're going to be releasing a, a hawk into the uh, wild and doing a few other fun things. So, uh, Marty, have a great time and uh, and, uh, and thanks for coming. This is thank you, great. sir. That's Jerry Jones. <laughs> That's a good so yeah, that was uh, a ton of fun, folks. And again, well, you saw it. It's also politicians. A lot of elected officials come. All the right people, all the people that you could ever want to meet and do business with or at the least time Super Bowl party. And I, I probably left out somebody. I was trying to think there's more Lee as I, there's a uh, Paxton Lynch was there. Uh, Tony Bruno and his wife. Uh, I'm going to do another video and present all of my friends that were there. Uh, this is just out, out, absolutely outstanding fun. Warren moon. And I believe I have, let's see here. Um, maybe, oh yeah, I, I mentioned that they're also Olympians and track stars and stuff like that. So I had, ladies and gentlemen, this is I had, this was from Super Bowl 50 and this is the legendary Maggie Vesey. I think it's, it'll be fun to close with Maggie. There's Maggie. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Maggie Vesey. She's a great track and field athlete as well as being incredibly looking. And if I may say, it's be like great abs. I mean, she's fantastic. Maggie is here at the Lee Library party. How do you like the party, Maggie? I'm having a great time. And it's actually better now that I met you, of course. Thank you. Oh, that's okay. I'm glad I can die now. It's like, <laughs> so what uh, projects you have going? Are you uh, is, in your profession, or are you going to be an actress? Or are you no, no. You should. Like, yeah. Right now, I'm training for the Olympic Games in Rio. Wow. And I also designed my own fashion line, and I race in my own uniform. Are you wearing what you designed? Uh, Maggie got the design. Right, it's out there. Yeah. Right now I'm wearing the I race in my own uniform. So just trying to draw attention to track and field and bring some new eyes to it. And, uh, how did you get the talent to developing your own products? Because that's really incredible. That's, you know, congratulations. I always wanted, I always had a point of view about what I wanted to wear. Uh, because it's a very big moments in my life. These right. races are very big. Right. Um, and I wanted to be able to mark those, you know, when you go to a special event, you wear a special outfit. Right. And, and so I thought I could make a connection with that. And, and for whatever reason, people all seem to be very connected through fashion. It's something that, you know, transcends worldwide. And right. I thought track and field could use some uh, livening up. Right. And, and you and Michelle Jenneke. She's uh, her girl did the dance with a wiggly her body oh, and everything. Oh right, right, you, you right. Know, you all have similar builds. In other words, I'm trying to say you're very, both very hot and well, that's, should command that's a lot what of eyeballs. That's it. That's right. That's right. That's right. But um, of course, you know, I, I get Flojo because she did Flo the. Flojo, I can get that. You know, it's, it's right. Do you have the nails though, or? Um, no, not the nails. I, I keep them pretty short. Okay, let's see, see that again. Let's see that again. I can put them on my abs. You can put them on yeah, your abs. Look at these abs, folks. I mean, I do, I'm sorry. The this is. Of the this is. I mean, I I'm I'm sweating. My you're not seeing me because I'm sweating right here. That's that's the idea. Tell me your website. MaggieBessie.com and. Please follow me on all my social media. It's all Maggie Betsy. So. And buy her products. Buy my products. Thank you, Thank Maggie. You. Thank you so okay. much. Well, thank you. So that's a good way to uh, close out. And now you know what to expect at the least time for Super Bowl party. I've given you one hour and nine minutes of some of the best of my Super Bowl videos over the years. I haven't shown you everything. And uh, I'm going to do another one of these shorter. But have fun at the event at the Ahern in Las Vegas. And remember, subscribe to Zenny62 on YouTube. Oh, and by the way, if you have reputation management issues that you want solved, send me an email right here, uh, zenny at zenny62media.net, zenny at zenny62media.net. And we will solve your reputation management problems for you. We're very good at it, okay? Check out the website, 
zenny62media.com. Not dot, not that. Well, you can use dot net, but it's dot com. All right. All right, folks. And uh, remember, Lee Steinberg Super Bowl party, the Ahern Hotel and Event Center, 300 West Sahara Boulevard, North Las Vegas Strip, February 10th, 12 o'clock to 5 o'clock, including the Brain Health Summit. If things change, I'll let you know. See you later.